What's up, YouTube? You're on a tree board for life. Basically, what I'm going to do, I'm going to talk to you about the um, differences in saddles um, today. And I basically, I just upgraded my saddle. I'm going to show you a little bit about why I chose this decision. Um, of course, I really do like my old climbing saddle, but um, it's very limited as to what I need to do. So, this is what I'm going to show you. Now, this is just a basic saddle. I mean, basic as it can get. And you got your rings just like that that now that controls your saddle that piece from right here there and that's what you, you kind of hook that under your legs and you'll be hooked in and of course you have this this kind of locks you in. it's not really no snap or anything but it's like a friction device it's like a almost like a belt buckle almost and it keeps you in and of course you got your D rings the attachment places on here and I really like this saddle but the only thing about it that I don't like is the back support. Okay, of course, when you're up in the tree for a long time, being eight, eight hours in a tree like this, like I've had to be before, all day long, basically, sitting on this can just wear your back out. And then, since it's so small, it puts a lot of pressure on your lower back. And these straps right here, as far as the saddle part of it, I don't like the idea. Um, I, like, I like it for what it does, but this tends to slide like it can be like low your legs like right behind your knee where my knees at right here below your legs or it can come up and be right about where you where you put your foot your wallet in your pocket at so sometimes you have to fight and constantly pull it down pull it down pull it down that's one thing I don't like plus safety things and other little spots on here wearing off um, of course you can see this belt's been down through there but this belt still has plenty of life in it I mean plenty of life probably can go along for years and years but I'm gonna retire this belt probably end up selling it to somebody maybe just starting out just a little starter belt something for them to just like it was for me like I said I've had this belt for a long time now I'm gonna move over to my new belt now this is a, um, a cougar and so I got a large because I'm getting bigger since about 18 and 19 and now I'm 26 so I got a little bigger than I was I'm probably about 200 something pounds climbing now even though I'm kind of short but and this is the cougar it's a weaver belt um it's very nice um has a rope bridge now i don't particularly care for the rope bridge so what i'll probably do i'll buy an o-ring or some kind of carabiner and then and then ended up maybe adding another attachment that way if this ever snaps i'll have a backup so i have two different rope bridges and tied into one and then what i do like about this i, I, I like the i like i, I like the um the part of this that is still a belt. That's what I really do like. Um, of course, you got your D-rings for your um, carabiner. And I love this asset. I mean, these are very thick and padded. Um, if you go around here, like just snap them boys on your legs. and You in and out that saddle in no time. Snap, snap. And it works out real good. And the back support, oh my, look at that. See how thick that is? It's real thick. I give or take all together you're looking probably like maybe about close to an inch inch and a half thick seems like with all the accessories now as I go around you got all these little extra loops put suspenders on parts like these fall arrest part although it's not particularly for fall arrest but you can add that stuff on here then you got accessory spots on here for you got I love this attachment part because you can see I can put my chainsaw on here then I can run something else underneath it with a, with a dog um, snap and of course you you know it kind of sets up like that but it's a real nice saddle and I really like it and um, again I just got this one this will probably run you place I got for cost me 239 normally ran for about 250 plus tax so it's a nice cheap saddle I mean ain't nothing you know irrigation or ain't no um irrigation I forget the other one or uh, Sequoia anything like that it might run you like five six hundred dollars but it's very nice and it's so the rope bridge and the thing I like about this is that here's the one thing I don't like about the old style as opposed to the rope bridge and you know it's a lot of good arborists when they have the work climb they'll use this type of belt when you got the D rings and you're tied in and you, and you got your saddle you see and you need to go left or right what ends up happening is that since these are tied in on the sides here like right there it tends to turn your belt so what will happen is you'll be like say if you you got double crotched in the, into a tree from one tree to another what end up happening as you, what a, your body will spin inside your belt so all this part of your saddle and your belt 
with the D-rings because they're attached to the belt right here. And so your D-rings, all this will turn. It'll turn. And so you don't really have a lot of leeway. I mean, you'll be inside spinning. And so what, what you'll have to do, say you get caught up and you, you hung a little bit and you have to turn around inside the belt to get to where these are in the front of you. And I don't like that idea. But with the rope bridge, the, the thing I do like about it is the fact that whenever you do have your carabine, let me show you because it's kind of hard for me to explain. I'm not the best explainer. But basically, this kind of rolls. It rolls from left to right. Left to right. So you don't have to move. Just this part moves. Now before, like again, like I'll show you over here. Before, this would, would not be like that. This is a big accessory clip. This is not for climbing. Like I said, this part, just like you can see here, basically just like what it does. When you move, when it moves, it turns the belt. See how it goes? It turns the belt. So, I just wanted to show you all my new belt. Um, it's real nice. Snazzy. Just something I wanted to um, kind of do a little review on. This, is, again, is the Weaver Cougar Saddle. Um, take it easy. You're on the tree boy for life. See you later.